Mingala Vashin. I'm Kimberly Phillips bringing you the top stories for DVB. Clashes between rebels and the Burmese army have forced hundreds to flee from a gold mining town in Burma's northernmost state. The Kachin Independence Army has been locked in fighting with Napidor troops near gold mining sites in Kamang Township, which caused locals to evacuate in search of safety. The most recent round of fighting broke out late last week. The KIA opened passageways for those fleeing the area in response, the majority of whom travelled to the towns of Michina and Namti under the escort of government forces. <laughs> The iconic Ubain Bridge has finally emerged from weeks of inundation. The Mandalay attraction has been hidden from sight since the end of July, the result of the monsoonal flooding of the Irrawaddy and Chindwin rivers. But it was finally reopened on Monday, much to the relief of local tour guides. Rates of smuggled pseudoephedrine from India has surged in Burma, which experts say is the result of poor coordination between the two countries. The drug, commonly found in cold medicines, has increasingly flowed into the country through the rugged border region over the last five years. The supply indicating the growing scourge of the national methamphetamine epidemic. So there's a lot of activity here indicating many types of smuggling are taking place, many types of trafficking. So it's, it's definitely a border that where cooperation needs to take place, where there needs to be concerted effort put uh, to, to kind of dampen that uh, transnational organized crime. You can find all of these top stories and more on dvb.no. Good night.